If you've been struggling with a legal battle, consider this soul scope as an affirmation that the worst is behind you. Trust that justice will be served, Aries. Trust that justice will be served in the most unexpected manner. As such, the divine forces are also conspiring to help you find a sanctuary of your dreams, if that's something you desire. As for Rams, who've been flirting with the idea of moving in together, now is the time to discuss the practical details of this grand plan. We get it, Taurus. You've been flirting with each other for a while. You've been dropping hints about what you wish to explore with them in the future. How about taking a direct approach for a change? How about telling them exactly how you feel as you make yourself vulnerable? Remember, there's no right or wrong way to begin this conversation. Lead with your heart and know that your heart will not lead you astray. But the fatigue is real and right now, the fatigue is encouraging you to hit the pause button and give yourself the TLC you deserve. So, hit the pause button and engage in activities that renew your spirit as you remember that everything you're dealing with is temporary in nature. On the upside, the pain and suffering associated with this chapter of your life is urging you to dip deeper and ask important questions. Word for the wise, sit down with the burning questions and allow the answers you are seeking to unfold in divine time. But the universe isn't working against you. And now, uh, it is in fact doing everything in its capacity to create a conducive environment for you to grow, evolve and become the most embodied version of yourself. So, look beyond the disappointments and disillusionments and keep putting in the work required. Redirecting your energy towards your big goals is highly recommended right now. P.S. Your hard work will yield magnificent results. In due course of time, we promise. Does it serve you, Leo? Does it serve you to doubt yourself and to descend into the rabbit hole of existentialism? Over and over? This is your reminder to call your power back to you to shake off the limiting beliefs and the complacency too. The new moon later this week will provide you with a golden opportunity to take that first step. Don't be afraid to move into the unknown, beautiful. Don't be afraid to choose yourself this time around. What's your favorite self-care ritual? Virgo, how do you feel called to nurture and nourish yourself? This is a good time to give yourself the TLC you desire. This is a good time to engage in activities that uplift your soul and renew your spirit. Remember, we're moving closer and closer to the dark moon. It's but natural to feel drained and disoriented at this time. Word for the wise, keep that to-do list minimal. Existence is always providing us with the perfect opportunity to grow, to heal, to transform, to show up as the most magnificent versions of ourselves. To show up as the version of ourselves we've been visualizing in our mind's eye. It's our ability to say yes and take more chances that defines the course of our lives, wild one. So, take more chances, Scorpio. Move through life knowing that the box is an illusion and that you have the permission to break your own rules. Remember, not everybody around you may validate the decisions you're being called to make. Take this as a sign that you're on the right track. It's true that the rules have been put in place for a reason, but the rules are also stifling you. They're hindering you from showing up in the world as the brightest, boldest version of yourself. This brings us to the question, how can you bring more fluidity and flexibility into the equation? As such, the desire to expand your mind and your consciousness is showing up strongly in your cards. Give yourself the permission to say yes to life. Give yourself the permission to lead with your heart. But you are not the stories you've been told about yourself. You are not your limitations either. Aquarius, you are the universe in ecstatic motion. You are the infinite potential in human form. So, step into the quantum field of possibilities this year. You're ready to build something larger than you have ever built before. You are ready to show up in the big, bad world as the most embodied version of yourself. You're in it, Pisces. You're in the life you manifested for yourself a long time ago. So, get out of your head and journey back to your heart. Feel the love, the gratitude, the grace, and the expansion. Give thanks for what is being offered to you right now and for what is yet to come. Trust that the blessings will multiply as you move through life, wild one.
As such, the upcoming new moon could bring with itself a big shift when it comes to your interpersonal relationships. Get ready to welcome new members into your soul tribe. We're talking about fellow unicorns who will bring more joy and sparkle into your experience.